welcome to Pumpkin Horror. Now, I mentioned that I did upload a video. If you came across it, you already know that I'm going to have three separate masks coming in today. And as a great thing, it actually was sitting on the porch when I woke up around 10.30 today. That's a good thing. So guess what? Now I have time to do videos based on these particular masks. But what I'm doing right now is I want to show you what's in the box. And then we'll do separate videos on the masks. Okay? Let's start off with the Michael Myers 1978 mask. Okay? It has a big schnozzola. Okay? Big old nose. Okay? And that one we're going to definitely do a review on. Okay? This is the Jason Voorhees Ruby's mask. It's got the skin, the head skin, along with the mask. Now what surprised me about this is the mask is, in fact, a different color. It's like a gray in color. It's not a bad thing, but it's kind of wide, too. We'll definitely have to check that one out, too, real soon, okay? This is my Trick or Treat Studios Dry Rot Mask from Jordu Shell. That is ridiculously cool looking, okay? We're definitely going to be checking that one out as well. Anyway, that is the update for so far. What I'm going to be doing here once I get done here is do those separate videos and upload them to Pumpkin Horror, okay? In the meantime, you guys have yourselves a good day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. We will see you later.